Hi, my name is Niranjan and welcome to another episode of Champak's IQ where we teach you simple science experiments that you can try at home. And in today's episode, I've got an awesome new assistant. This is Amar. Say hello to everyone. Hi. So, Amar, what do you think I have in this bottle here? Bottle, sand and a stick. Right? So, you think this is sand? Yes. I am telling you this is glue. I'll prove it. Pick it up. You see that? That's how it's glue. Actually, no, it's not glue. What it is is actually it, it, he's right it is it, it is sand but you know how I did this no well before you came to, to the studio well before anybody came to the studio I snuck in and I brought a lot of sand with me I grabbed the bottle and I poured it in then I started tapping it against the the, the, the table over and over again so I add more and I tap some more and add more and tap some more what would, what happened then was it all the small particles of sand they start sinking down leaving all the big particles right at the top so then when I push this in it gets nicely locked in and when i pick it up it gets stuck now do you know what is the science behind this no well it's called friction well friction is when two or two objects rub against each other and it doesn't move very very smoothly you know that when you try rubbing your hands right your hands don't move that quickly whereas if you try rubbing your hands against ice you just slip right so when you push the skew or the stick into it without tapping it down what happens is you got a lot of particles a lot of space between the particles the particles are are, are, are arranged randomly but when you start tapping it down what happens is all the smaller particles start sinking through the gaps right to the bottom now the places where there was empty space before it right now has grains of sand and when you start when you poke the skewer inside the particles start start rubbing against the skewer and you get friction while the particles are tiny their combined surface area is large enough to exert a lot of friction right and it's also rubbing against the surface area of the skewer so when you pick it up it gets stuck there of course that doesn't stop you from pulling it out like that but You have to realize that friction is the reason why. Oh, look, it's still happening. So, are you gonna go home and try this? Yes. Well, so am I. We're both gonna try this, and I suggest you try it at home too. My name is Niranjan. This was Champak Psyche, brought to you by Champak and One Network. Thank you so much, and please subscribe.